Hello there, you have ordered Matt Prime Beef It and Matt, bringing you another daily dose of the Town of London behind closed doors during the lockdown. Very privileged today. I've been allowed into the White Tower, it's usually locked up. They're doing some fire and safety checks, so I'm going to scoot through and show you some of the things that you'd see if you were to come and see us, when you come and see us. Behind me is something quite amazing. I can't show you how amazing it is on a small screen like this but it's called the Line of Kings. It's possibly um, the oldest man-made tourist attraction in the world. And it is wooden horses with the Kings of England on them. And as we walk down, you'll see there's many of them. And it really is worth coming to see these. They are absolutely fantastic and go back, I believe, to the 1650s. But what I really like in here, what a lot of people like to come and see, is Henry VIII. Henry VIII's armour, and there is, set behind me there, is horse armour. Beautifully inscribed. I can't show you how amazing it is on this small screen, but it's all beautifully inscribed. Very athletic man when he was younger. You can see by the, the size of that armour. In fact, looking at Henry VIII's armour, as we will do in a moment as he gets older, it's very much like having a little peek through my wardrobe. It all starts fairly thin, uh, and then... As life goes on, it expands in various directions. So we go from a fairly um, thin Henry VIII there, and as we walk around a little bit, we come to another armour right behind me. Here it is. And I'll try and get you a better angle. There it is. All of a sudden, he's got a little bit bigger. Now, this armour here is very famous, and it's famous for the codpiece there, right in the middle there. There's the cod piece there. And if I come to the side, you'll see what I mean. There we go. That cod piece there is psychological warfare. A lot of rumours going around that Henry VIII wasn't producing the goods, didn't have it in him. So this cod piece says, look at me, look at what I've got. And just to prove to you that we are testing the fire alarms, one's gone off. Now this cod piece and the whole armour is now behind glass. Never used to be. In Victorian times, we don't know where it came from, the rumour went round, if you came and you put a pin in the gap of the codpiece in between the metal and the, the material inside, then you would become pregnant. So it was getting ruined by hordes of barren Victorian women pouring into the tower to handle Henry VIII's codpiece. But if we go around even further, I'll try and go around further without tripping up, it's quite a, a small area. Now, the public would normally come past here and walk on, but I promised you that we would have some behind the scenes, and this is it. If you know where to go, it'll be locked when you come back, so don't try any tricks. But I've had it unlocked. If we need to get around quickly, we can press on these, and the whole breastplate wall where I'm standing swings open, and we can get straight through. And these are to be used during the day for emergencies, for first aid incidents, etc. So, that's my first look at the White Tower. If I'm lucky, I'll be allowed to come back a little bit later, maybe tomorrow, and do another one. In the meantime, keep safe, take care, look after yourselves. Be fit and Matt, signing off.